always had a huge interest in fusing different dance styles together. Uh, it, I, it, my inspiration really was Fred Astaire and Sid Charisse. You know, wonderfully danced with Ginger Rogers, then he danced with Sid Charisse, his classically trained dancer, and will it work? And of course, it, it worked marvellously. What I thought would be a lot of fun is sort of doing what I do on these bodies, on these contemporary, these classically trained bodies, and seeing what comes out because they can't do ballroom at all. Um, I don't really do contemporary. I've done it a bit in what seems like 100 years ago. But and then you can have your moment, your artistic moment. I don't know what you're doing. Oh. Oh. Have to be always this way. So we've just had, we've just have a sort of a coming together, a, a fusion of styles and ideas, and and it's just been a joy. It's been enormous fun. They've been wonderful to work with. It's very interesting. Always, I think these the, the girls um, notice a massive difference between dancing with with me and we're dancing with one of their boys from from their style. Well, I think it's a I think it's a power really. I think it's a personality. I think it's a uh, a command of them, really, and and uh, and they feel safe. I think it's a it's a feeling of safeness that they get from dancing with me. That's because of the way we dance as a, as born dancers. Is we dance in hold all of the time, so we're very aware of our lady. This thing here, whoosh, whoosh, and um, does that make sense? Yeah. For the next series, um, who would I like? Um, Pippa Middleton might be a bit of fun, might she? But they'll probably give me her mum. <laughs>